Hello everybody, I am Roberto Ferrari from the University of Ferrara and I'm here to tell you that to have elevated blood pressure is bad. It damages the heart, the brain and the kidney. And the problem is that you do not feel the level of pressure in the pipes of your body. For this reason, hypertension or high blood pressure is considered the silent killer. This is because there is too much salt in your meal. So please, my message to you is please, please reduce the salt in your meal. Cook with less salt. Remember, this is an SOS. Step down with your salt. It's very important for your health. Of course, this can be done. And Dr. Casey Risha will tell you how to do it. Thank you, Dr. Robert Perry. I do agree with you that in creating awareness for the step down of high salt intake, especially in the Indian scenario, as you've said, there is an increase in the incidence of hypertension in India, which is linked to high salt intake. So usually uh, the Indian diet is rich in salt. So the daily intake of salt in Indians is almost 11 grams per day, as opposed to the WHO recommended dose of 5 grams, which is more than double. So um, this high salt intake leads to high blood pressure, which is an important risk factor for heart attack, stroke, and kidney disease. So what are the different measures we need to take to reduce this salt intake in India? One of them is to reduce the salt in the rice and also in the dough, which uh, we use to make chapatis and kodis. And do not sprinkle salt in rice or um, the curd rice we use and boiled vegetables. So try to savor their natural taste. We cannot completely cut down the salt. So what we do is reduce the amount of salt we add in cooking in a grated amount till we get a minimal amount. So and uh, it should start at the childhood level itself so that the children get accustomed to this low salt diet. And India is very fond of this food accompaniments like chutneys, pickles, uh, especially this uh, salt mixes and masala chars and all of that. We tell them to limit it. If you already have high BP, then avoid those uh, food accompaniments. And that's it. And for those who have this temptation, who cannot avoid the temptation of salt, what we follow is what you cannot see, you do not want, like out of sight, out of mind. So remove the salt from salt container from the table. So uh, let's fight the battle for hypertension together and make people aware on step down of salt intake. Thank you.